How's it going guys? Neo Chino here. And this is a pickups video from uh, Long Island Retro Gaming Expo. I was there on August 12th and 13th with my buddy Jamie from 1UP Games. And uh, we were both selling our goods there. And I want to say it's our first time. It was my first time being at the show. And I was definitely surprised by it. Uh, the setup's great. The guy that runs it's great. I believe his name is Joe. I uh, could be wrong on that. But uh, definitely had one of the largest free play areas that I've ever seen uh, I was definitely uh, taken back by that some of the vendors there were super nice um, never saw vendors that nice ever in my life all trying to help you out constantly uh, it was an overall great show and I highly recommend it to anyone else that does cons or whatever it's a good show to go to a lot of rare stuff there um, yeah so here's what I got there On the first day I got um, I bought this, it had no cart, but it was the Jungle Book box and manual. I got this for well under what it goes for. I think I got it for like 15 bucks. So I was pretty psyched to get that first day, first thing. And the second thing I bought on the first day from one guy was uh, I needed the box for this and he had it 100% complete, so I just bought it complete. And uh, it's a real minty box, and he gave me a good deal on it. I got this and this chiller manual for a real good price on that one score. And uh, in the next, I got, well, actually from that same guy the next day, we made a little deal. And I got this game here, King or, this, or Manual, sorry, King Neptune's Manual. I don't have the cart or box for this yet, but... That's a good manual to have for an unlicensed game without a doubt. The next, <clears throat> from um, actually a vendor across from me, I did a trade with them. And I wound up getting two Sega Masters games. Both complete. Delivious, Valley of Doom, however you saw it, say it. And uh, I got Wanted. Both complete, real nice shape. Happy to get that. And then... Um, my buddy Steve, well, a guy that I just met there, he runs, uh, I'm not sure if he runs or owns, but he's from, uh, what was it, Brooklyn Video Game Store, and, uh, did I, yeah, he gave me a great deal on this Honeybee adapter, the gold Honeybee, to play Famicom for NES, and funny, that next day, I found a guy there that, uh, had the white one complete in box and I got this one as well so now I have both honeybees that they made and uh, yeah now I can play Famicom cards go after them and also while I was there because now that I have two honeybees obviously I have to get some Famicom cards my buddy Mike from uh, the video game trading post hooked me up with some complete in box Famicom cards this is uh, a sports game I believe it's uh Hyper Sports, and this is like a Mahong game, and uh, Peach Boy Legends, looks like an RPG, these are all complete in box, they're not expensive, but complete in box games, why not, and he gave me a great deal on them, and also, like the kid that I met recently in the last time I was in Long Island from that same store from my store the video game trading post Chris we did a little deal uh, he's a big Neo Geo collector and I'm a collector for Neo Geo as well he's way past me though and uh, he was looking for the uh, inserts for an NES top loader and I so have to uh, come across a box and inserts for a top loader for a real good price and I traded him that box and inserts for Last Blade 2 MVS cart. So I'm happy to add this one to the collection. Now that I have an MVS cabinet, these are a lot more fun to play. And um, thanks for the deal, Chris. We both made out in that one without a doubt. And also, I picked up a bunch of manuals from uh, Richard Breezen. He owns. Uh... Shit. What the hell is the name of the place? 
plan trade, the last plan trade. I'm not sure if it really is plan trade, but he's the owner of that. He's a hell of a nice guy. And he hooked me up on a lot of manuals that I got to complete some games like Spyro. Uh, and some Genesis manuals, Rage, Mortal Kombat 2, X Mutants, Super Star Wars, F Zero, all kinds. And I took this out of the control deck that I got. I mean, he just gave me a ton of manuals here. Tons. Roger Clemens, Gradius, Krusty, Separation Anxiety, War of the Gems, Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3, Desert Strike, MechWare 3050, Judge Dredd, Kirby Dreamland 3, Kirby Superstar, Star Fox, Super Star Wars, Super Street Fighter, Tony Hawk 2, Tony Hawk, Toy Story 2, Pokemon Snap. Great deal on all these. He's a hell of a nice guy. Like I said, definitely glad I went to this convention because I met a lot of nice people there that, you know, are in it for all the good reasons, without a doubt. Made some great trades, great deals. And uh, also, <clears throat> I made a trade with my buddy Jamie so he can get something that he wanted, that the guy wanted that I had. So I traded him for uh, Superman, box and cart, and complete in box Beatles Adventure Racing for the value of my stuff for what the guy wanted for his. And I also got off Jamie before we left. Mega Man 5 manual to complete all my Mega Mans for NES. Phantom Fighter and Tiny Toons with Racky Races 2. Or Adventures 2 Wacky Race. Wacky Land, Wacky World. And my big pickup from the show would be this. I actually didn't buy this in the case it's in. I got the case now, but it's a Racer Mate Challenge 2 cart pretty nice with all the labels on it and everything and I also got that with the dongle which is just as hard to find as well so now I only need a couple more pieces to complete that if I, that ever happens but I'm good to have those two things now in my collection and that's all that I picked up from the uh, convention but yeah the convention overall blast great time awesome people uh, the guy that runs it's great the vendors there are super nice super cool for the free play room which I'm going to show you right now huge and uh, here's the free play room right here
belong when I have a couple of the um, the vendors that were there that I dealt with, like Mike from the Video Game Trading Post, Eric Breezen, uh, I'm pretty sure his name is, from the Play and Trade. They're going to be linked down below. Um, and yeah, next year, if you're not doing anything, I know they haven't announced any dates yet, but this year is at the Cradle of Aviation Museum in Garden City, New York, August 12th and 13th with Long Island Retro Gaming Expo. Great time, awesome place, awesome venue. Um, they also have a, a video game museum in the inside the, the museum, so it's pretty neat. Check it out. And uh, this is Neo Geo saying, keep mashing buttons. Enjoy.